Hang on, pop up really quick so I know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Derek, and you're watching this week's episode of... Newman, Newman 365. 365. I've been trying to join FCA for about 10 years. So I'm gonna rap for you just so you understand why I'm going to win this rose. Yo, my name is Gage. I'm always on the rage. I keep you on your toes, so give me this rose. Um, I am uh, in the color guard. A lot of people like to tell me that's not a sport, but um, I would like to see you wave around um, those beautiful, colorful flags. It's very difficult. This rose is mine. I'm an avid tennis player, table tennis that is. I've been playing for six years and I joined FCA because I like fellowship and competition in a healthy manner. I want to win really badly, I want to find love. Thank you for this opportunity. Now this was a very tough decision, but a very important rose ceremony. And I have to give this rose to Bulby. It's Bobby. Bobby. Yeah! Good on you it! I have never been so honored to be chosen by FCA to be the winner of this rose. You know, the other contestants, I think they were really good sports. Um, but in the end, you know, guess who came out on top? Bowley. <laughs> Sarah here with the FCA update. We are selling roses for Valentine's Day. We're calling it Cupid's Delivery Service. Today is the last day to buy roses for your significant other or friend. We will be handing them out on Monday, February 13th. Um, if you guys missed the date to buy a rose or chocolates, then you can DM us on Twitter at Newman underscore FCA. Paige Thompson here. Follow me around as I ask people questions about Valentine's Day. What are your plans for Valentine's Day? I'm going to class. I'm definitely not going on a date. <laughs> I actually have an event for Fugate residents to decorate cupcakes. I'm going to spend it with my girlfriend. I love that. I am going to go on a date with my niece and nephew for Valentine's Day because they're the best dates. Sitting at home with my husband and my son because I'm a mom and that's what moms do. She's a good mom, I promise. What are your plans for Valentine's Day? Yep, those are good. It's the most romantic time of the year. It's the most romantic time of the year. Hit me up. If your secret admirer was watching, what would you want them to know? God, I'm so uncomfortable. Um, that she is so <laughs> uncomfortable. <laughs> oh. Oh, I don't have to worry about that. And I've probably made too many people mad, so I don't have any of those. <laughs> I like dogs. All right. <laughs> I don't. Thanks for giving me a chance almost a year ago. Who would your celebrity Valentine be? Uh, I gotta go with the Royals. Gotta go with somebody funny like Salvador Perez. That'd be a good one. I agree. I'm gonna go with Leonardo DiCaprio because um, Titanic is my favorite film and I would kill to be Rose. I I'd probably would want to talk to somebody like Ronald Reagan. Thanks for watching, and if you didn't know, Valentine's Day is on Tuesday, so you better find some plans. I was thinking I would just fill up my bathtub with like mac and cheese, and I would read like a romance novel, and then I would eat the whole tub of mac and cheese. And then take a shower, because I would be covered in cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Oh,
there's anybody in here, but happy Valentine's Day. Ooh. If your secret admirer will... <laughs> <laughs> Why don't do this stuff?